Here's what would happen if Santa Claus was actually a quantum being. First, forget the sleigh moving at supersonic speeds. If Santa is quantum, he doesn't travel. He exists in a state of superposition. So, uh, basically, he is a giant probability cloud smeared across the entire planet. He isn't flying from house to house. He is mathematically present in all 800 million chimneys simultaneously. Now, for the reality anchor. This is the observer effect, demonstrated famously by the Weizmann Institute experiment in 1998. They proved that particles behave like waves, right up until you set up a detector to watch them. The moment you look, the wave collapses into a single particle, and this brings a dark twist to the lyrics, he knows when you are awake. See? That's not a song, it's a physics warning. If you wake up and sneak a peek downstairs, you become an observer. You entangle your system with his. And here's the kicker. By looking, you force his wave function to collapse. He instantly snaps from being everywhere to being just a single, physical guy in your living room. That means by trying to catch him, you physically delete him from everyone else's house, ruining Christmas for billions of kids just because you caused a decoherence event. So, keep your eyes closed. It's not about being good. It's about preventing a global quantum error.